Yo, what is up? This is Stein Fox, Jarl of the Tribe of the Grey Horn Pagans, host of the Grey Horn Pagans podcast. Um, I wanted to make a comment real quick. Uh, I have been talking to someone, commenting a bit on, um, you know, finding groups, making groups, founding tribes as to connect heathens, pagans, witches and all with each other. And she said, and this is this is nothing, this is no flag towards her, but that she doesn't want to use the term tribe um, in order to respect the indigenous people, um, indigenous people of America, I'm assuming, since she is American. Um... It is not just the indigenous Americans who lived in tribes. It is the indigenous Europeans as well. Like way before our countries unified and connected with each other and is now like one big country, like we still have the provinces. Um, we were nothing but a bunch of tribes, like very loosely connected to each other politically. Usually, you know, you'd have sons and daughters of different tribes marrying with each other or trade going on or whatever. Um, the biggest example I can give is what we now know as Germany, their Germanic people. They all lived in tribes. It wasn't one unified Germany. It wasn't one unified Germanic people. It was tribes living in the different provinces of uh, what we now know as Germany. Same with France, you know, the Frankish people. They were also nothing but tribes, you know. Uh, read the stories of uh, Asterix, Asterix and Obelix. Um, you know, you'll, they were a tribe. They come from a tribe. Um, same with the, the Celtic people, the, the people from Iberia. Um, they were all tribes. <laughs> Everything, anything that isn't unified, if you will, that is a um, a community separate from the rest you could call a tribe. The, of course, the, there is some nuance uh, with that, but it's not just the indigenous Americans or Africans who live and lived in tribes. Here in Europe, we lived and live in tribes as well. It's just not talked about. Just wanted to mention that. No flag, no shit, just info.